Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. This is Glacier Kano here today to play some more Halo 4 multiplayer. And this time it is going to be like the last hurrah for like the fourth time in a row or something like that. I say all the time, like, yeah, this is going to be the last time I'm playing Halo 4, but I keep playing it because, I mean, that happened with the Master Chief Collection, and I mean, who knows if Halo 5 is going to work? It probably will work, but it might not at the same time. So I thought I might as well end the way I started in Halo 4 on the Infinity screen because it looks so amazing. That and also, I had to do this because you never know how long it will take before I find a match. And I might not have enough time to talk, but... Somebody had mentioned again for like the 50th time that you should show off your classes, so here we go. Do I, I don't think I even really need to go into it because, I mean, you can see right there, but... My infamous Screw You class, it's been, like, exactly the same since that one update with Recharge, because Recharge is amazing. And, I mean, I really felt the pain of not having Recharge. Oh, man. In the, the Xbox One version, because... Oh, man. You gotta have, gotta have Recharge. And then this is my class. I'm gonna call it the Tryhard class, because it usually... Usually. Well, I mean, I guess it technically usually was used for Ricochet that I had, and this was one with a carbine, yeah, and also it had a jetpack and stuff like that, but things changed, okay? Now it's the tryhard class. And then, of course, the BTB class, which I may or may not have changed since last time, because, I mean, I wanted to test out if having a light rifle on it would help. It might with having, like, no legs, so who knows? Wheelman and Gunner for the win. Then, of course, <laughs> the class I never use. The Anti-Promethean Vision class. With all new hologram abilities. So, I mean, I was going to have Promethean Vision on the Anti-Promethean Vision class, but then the Promethean Vision person would probably see the other Promethean Vision and go, Why is this person Promethean Visioning when I can't see them because they're stealth? So hologram they should be able to see, but then stealth they shouldn't. That's the plan of it, at least. I don't know why I have Grenadier, but I mean... If you're stealthy, you might as well use grenades. Mass Effect thinks it's true, so I, I trust Mass Effect. Stealth people use grenades, and they can't kill robots. And then, of course, as we all know, this class, I don't even have a name for it. Let's... Maybe I can call it the Hollow by Gram class, because, I mean, I, I just love saying that. Hollow by Gram! But, yeah, light rifle, battle rifle, pretty standard. And a bit of dexterity, because it's not try hard enough without it. So, yeah, that, those are my classes, and if anybody ever asks, I can point them to this video. Yeah, thumbs up for everybody. Woo! So happy. Now I'm actually going to play stuff. And as always, for a last hurrah of sorts... I have to choose Team Action Sack. I absolutely have to. Because, I mean, how can you not play the actions of Sacks if you can? But I might not be able to. Who knows? Who knows? There's never as many people playing this as much as I liked before, because... When the Action Sack playlist first came out, it was the rave of the nation. They were just having a bunch of glow sticks all over the place, but now... I can only find four people within, like, ten seconds. That's that's absolutely terrible. <laughs> absolutely terrible. That I'd like to mention first and foremost, because, I mean, I have a lot to talk about today. I'm trying out a new system for, like, dampening the echo effect in my room, because, I mean, it's very, very echoey in here. Wait. Meta Raid? I don't think I've ever played that before. They have new action sack game types? Did not know that, but yeah, I'm trying to dampen the echo with many, like, blankets and towels hanging from various structures. And by various structures, I mean a, a closet door and stuff like that. I think it helped a little bit. It's probably still very, very echoey, and I can still hear myself echo a bit, but it's better. It's better. But let's see what the new meta is on... Using raid to kill insects. You never know, it could be getting Ant Man to flush out their systems. 
Man, that would be really bad. That would be really bad. That's That probably could be a villain if it isn't already a villain in the Ant-Man universe. That needs to be a thing. I don't know if they're still making Ant-Man comics. They probably are, because, I mean, Marvel makes new things all the time. But what? Maybe I did play this before. That looks familiar. Oh, yeah, I've seen this. I... I'm going to change my audio. <laughs> Just turn down a slight amount, but... Yeah, this is the game type that has... Um, random weapons, and it's a straight-on capture the flag. How- Where- where's everybody? This is a trap. This is gonna be totally a trap. I don't- oh, maybe they just didn't have any teammates. That might have been a- But I think it's a trap, but I mean, I'm going in anyway! I'm a distraction! That's my main goal at life! Oh no. <laughs> oh well. I still distracted them enough that, uh, we got their flag, like... 10 centimeters away. Now let's just throw in a ton of explosives. Aw. That one explosive deflected my explosive. Ended up non being explosive anymore. But yeah, there's an Ant Man they need to have. Whoa! An enemy. Which is all about just like using raid on them, on the ants. And you're just like, no! This is not good! So, that's. That's my Ant Man villain of the day. That's, that's gonna be a new thing now. Ant-Man villain of the day. I think that there's a guy with a binary, like, up there just... ...destroying all of us. But yeah, this is essentially what always happens in this game type. One team is close to the other, but then they can't really capture anything. But you never know, we could, we could be lucky. So, I mean, I'm a pretty good distraction. That's basically my entire goal of this. If I go positive, good. If not, I mean... What the heck? I think... Where's, where's that rocket? I can't find the rockets. Um... Please be rockets. That's a suppressor. Okay. Oh well. If this was Halo 5... Oh, here we go. I think, because I think the suppressor is a lot better than that. Yes! Okay, one rocket kill. I just need to kill like... Oh. I think I might have killed myself with the splash damage. But yeah, I think the suppressor is actually a lot better than Halo 5. We're gonna find out in a couple weeks, because that's, that's still another reason why I'm just like, this is the last hurrah. No, it isn't. Because I keep forgetting what day... Oh, no. Okay, I think that was a fuel rod. I, I keep forgetting what day uh, Halo 5 actually does come out. Ow! Please don't. <laughs> oh, man. I love this sniper rifle. It's so good. So, my entire team is sniping. That's probably a good thing. Yeah, literally, my entire team has sniper rifles. This is amazing. Okay, I'm running in. Running in close quarters. Let's see if I can still do any uh, sort of snapshotting. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Who, who and where has the... Okay, there they are. I don't trust any of those thermal detonators. What are they called again? I don't remember. Sticky, sticky rocket launcher. Oh. Hey, I juggled it forward a little bit. I'm getting it. How much time do we have? 30 seconds? I can do it. Oh, man. That was such a bad idea, but... Rocket launcher? Okay. I have a little bit more time. No, oh, you idiots! Actually, he was a pretty good, uh... Little bit of... A distraction. <laughs> How am I surviving? Yeah, I was waiting for that assassination on me. I should have been running the other direction, but... Here we go. I think this might be the first flag capture I ever see in this. It might be. I'm gonna throw... Yes! I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna be the, the savior of our nation. I will be the one! Yes! I can't believe it. That's the first time I've ever seen a flag capture in this mode. Oh, man. Now that, if that doesn't get your adrenaline running, then I don't know what does. Probably eating a sandwich. I mean, because that takes a lot of adrenaline. Just ask Ellis. Oh no. That's another uh, new segment that's going to be happening. Ask Ellis. Uh, and then you just use a random clip from inside of... Oh no. Have some incineration, please. I, I, wait a... Okay. I didn't give him enough incineration as he probably would have wanted, but... Okay. 
So yeah, what you do is you just take a voice clip from Left 4 Dead, and then you go. Let's see if- oh, I, I think I missed completely. But, oh well. Doesn't really matter too much. Because, yes! I'm really amazed that I actually have a killing spree or anything like that so far though, because... Because usually this, this game type just ends in destruction for all! Okay, you go up in there, I'll cover you with explosions. He's probably not going to go in there, so I'm going to just cover myself with explosions. It, it feels nice. Don't, don't question it. It feels very, very nice. Delightful. Oh no, 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 no. Here we go. That's such a waste. That's such a waste. <laughs> oh well. Uh, wait, did I? Oh yeah, I had two shots left. I probably should just use them. Because that's one kill. And now I gotta reload. Hopefully nobody will notice this big glowing man next to him. But, speaking of another gun in Halo 5 that will be amazing, or probably not actually, is a Cineration Cannon. I've seen things, man. I've seen too many things. <laughs> this should not be possible, especially since there was a spinning pendulum of a binary. Well, that wasn't binary, that was... <laughs> I'm gonna throw some grenades in there. Okay. Speaking of binary, though... Oh boy, there's just so much ammo for everything. Millions of peaches. Peaches for free. Okay. I think we, at this point, this might be a good idea just to, like, completely and utterly just destroy them and make it so they can't get out of their own base. Because, I mean, this is fun. I love it. <laughs> I got a rampage before I died. Oh boy. Oh. I was gonna take that weapon. I think they're, one of those was a sniper rifle. Okay, let's see if they can get out of their base at all. I kind of doubt it. So that's kind of a good... Ooh. No, you don't. I was really close. Also, he he reloaded the gun for me, so I mean, I was, I was very happy with that. I don't know how I got a double kill, but... I guess it happens every once in a while. And I can't get that binary! There's a binary right there! Okay. But I'm gonna just keep mentioning, like, Halo 5 as much as possible, because, I mean, this is another gun that's somewhat better in Halo 5. This... This monstrosity that I forget the name of. But then again, it's actually pretty good in this game, too, to be fair. But, I mean, it was, it's better at longer range from what I've seen. Because, I mean, I've, I've been doing my research, and you gotta be keeping doing your research on Halo 5, because, I mean, I want to be the very best when I, when I first get to play it. But I, th I have a strange feeling that I might be the MVP of this, uh, game. Ah, For getting blown up right there. Ooh, actually, I did not say no to these weapons. Oh no! Although, <laughs> you know it's a sad day when you get shot in the face by a non-zoomed-in light rifle. Woohoo! We win! First time I've ever seen somebody win this game type. I don't think there's... Maybe there's no team damage on that. If so, that's really good for that too, because I mean... If you're raiding with a bunch of huskies on your side, you don't want them to accidentally bite your ankles. It happens. So... Man, that was really fun. <laughs> Probably, yeah, still the best match I've ever had on that version of a game type. But yeah, who knows the day when Halo 5 ever comes out. I gotta tell that story at some point, because, I mean, it was, it's just so bad that I forget the times, and I book off the wrong days of work. That's basically all the story is. I booked off the wrong day, because I thought it was the 20th that Halo 5 comes out. Nope, 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 it's the 27th, so. That's something to note, and something else to note. Man, Hendrix, he's just shredding some tunes and shredding some people. I wonder what was this with a sniper rifle. I approve of that guy. Oh no. I want to keep looking at my stats though. So <laughs> look at that. I was plus 28. That shouldn't happen. Napoleon. I'll do it. Or Neapolitan. Action sack on Neapolitan. It's just a world of ice cream. Much better than a world of goo. But yeah, anyway, that's that's still just like all my story was. Of just like not knowing the day of 
Halo 5 when it comes out. That also just like planning for the future of when I'm recording things. Capture the flag. Oh. Oh. Is this what I think it is? It's... This was mini CTF all the time? I did not actually... I did not pay attention to what I was voting for then. Okay. Good to know. I'll just take some concussion rifle, and hopefully that will work. So, I mean, I'm not very good at mini slayer. We all know that from, from a few times when I was drinking while playing. That's like the only time that I played mini slayer. And I mean, it was glorious. Oh. Well, I mean, if they're gonna just leave their flag undefended, why not? <laughs> oh, they stole our flag too? No! Uh, you, you can't punch in this game type. Do you not know that? Ugh. Because I don't think you can even assassinate people, can you? <laughs> Why do you keep trying to punch? It doesn't work. But yeah, I have a feeling still. Oh, look at me. I'm just so stickly. Like one of those insect things. But, oh, nice. I spawned right next to my dead body, so I got... Oh, all the best in the weapons. Oh. Well, this is going to be a very hard-fought victory, I think, for this mini slayer. I have a strange... Must get... No! I just want your ammo. I keep checking my back just in case, though, because I keep thinking that people can just, like... Oh, no. So you never know if people can actually do anything in the way of assassinations or not. I don't think that... They can, but... No! There we go. Aw. Oh. Okay, so maybe you can only punch when you actually have the flag. Or maybe they patched it? I don't know, I haven't played Mini Slayer for a long time, so maybe... As I was saying with the new meta... The new meta in Mini Slayer is to punch non-stop. Oh, we are winning, okay. I just had to check. Hey, hey you! Oh, I keep forgetting that you have grenades. Oh no. Um, I, I might need to go for their flag then. I might need to go for their flag. There's a guy standing right next to their flag, I think. Oh boy. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. Oh boy. That's actually not that bad of a strategy for Mini Slayer though. What you do, well specifically for this <laughs> too. I spawned down here. Okay, uh, take the, take the grab hammer. I dare ya. It doesn't work very well. Maybe it does, I don't really... I don't think I've ever had the grab hammer in Mini Slayer. Maybe I had once, but... Yeah, they're gonna win. It's it's just too hard. It's just too hard to play uh, CTF with uh, Mini. March of the Minis. But hey, at least I was essentially the MVP again. That's what happens in CTF. I'm the CTF master. And I mean, that doesn't count that I lost that CTF match, oh no. <laughs> because I had that one streak going on before where I never lost, like, any CTF, but... Mini CTF, that doesn't count. No, 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 no. It takes a lot of XP. It takes a lot more XP, XP than I thought to get to, uh... Like, up a level. Oh well. I was... I was still one of the most positive people, surprisingly enough. I don't know how or why it matters in Mini Slayer, but, you know, you know how it works. <laughs>